Yes, crew. So what I've done here, I've, I've discovered like up here, you've got um, presets. You can have the sine wave. You've also got triangle wave, which is a bit more grungy. And then you've got, you have to click here, by the way, and then right click, ramp up. I mean, this computer is way ahead of its time. Man. I've got a bit of reverb on this, by the way, so that's what it sounds like that. And then, let me see, uh, ramp down. You can mix waveforms. So, say, like, for example, you put a sign on this one. That give you a bass, and you can mix type of bassy one. So you've got your little low in there. You've got noise. That's pretty deep. And then maybe a little bassy version. Let's go to here. Uh, let's see what we could do. So we've got that noisy one. Let's click here. Then add the sine wave here. Then mix the two. That's pretty dark, man. And then the uh, clear wave. Whatever that is, I, th I think that's anything. I think that just clears the wave totally. So this is how you put your wave on. So pop it down. Right, let's see what speed's all about. What's that do? some other crazy thing okay so we want that up here and then I'll what I want to try to pitch it down as quick as I can so to let me just try 290 to maybe 210 let's see what that yeah, nice little little bass sound there. Put an FFF there to mute it off. That's definitely worth a little resample. Right, let's see what else we got. Uh, go back into that synth. Let's change the waveform to maybe here. Let's go to this one. So we're on that one. Let's get get that sine wave in there, and then mix it. I think the mix is the volume there. Uh, okay, so, um, yeah, so that's pretty much it on the synthesizer. There are some other types. Uh, don't can't recall messing with those, but when I do, I will let you guys know. Um, yeah, guys, so if you want to see more videos like this, please, when I get to 50 likes, I'll upload another one. So please smash that like button. That's it for today's video. Take care. God bless. Peace. I'm a